Well, now that President Joe Biden is out of the presidential race, critics are going even further by saying he should resign from the presidency, citing his debate performance last month and his health issues. President Biden has vowed he will finish out his last few months in office. Our political reporter, Justin Gick, is here with more. Justin. Monica, former President Trump is one of those critics and said that President Biden is too mentally incompetent to remain in the White House. He has inquired of Kamala Harris whether she believes, knowing that Joe Biden has withdrawn from the campaign because of his rapidly deteriorating condition, if the people of America are safe and secure with Mr. Biden in the White House for six more months. Presidential historian Rick Collins says he thinks President Biden will finish out his term. He says, like all presidents, Mr. Biden is concerned about his legacy. Collins says there's really no reason for him to resign the office at this point. He says once the president serves out his final months, he can look back with some real sense of accomplishment. This is a very unprecedented situation. We've never seen a major presidential candidate withdraw from the race this late in the election year. Uh, and President Biden had the nearly 4,000 delegates that he needed for uh, renomination. So his renomination is merely a formality at this point. Uh, there is a whiff of similarity to two other Democratic presidents, Lyndon Johnson in 1968 and Harry Truman in 1952. Uh, they both were running for re-election, but they withdrew after just one primary, uh, the New Hampshire primary. And Truman lost that primary to Tennessee Senator Estes Kefauver. Johnson narrowly won his against Minnesota Senator Eugene McCarthy. But they withdrew uh, much earlier. We've never seen it this late in the campaign year. Collins says this is also unprecedented as we have never seen national leaders within a president's party urging him to withdraw. Collins says it's too early to judge President Biden in the history books, but he certainly has been a significant uh, president with his half a century commitment to public service.